carried by all Mac Movies Industries of Progress. Benny, how are you? Fine, How was school today? That was fair. Well, you know, there are rumors that the lecturers will soon go on strike again. Mm -hmm. That sounds you right. How? If you had agreed to study abroad, all these issues of strike won't arise. <laughs> Mommy, how long will I continue to make emphasis that I am a Nigerian? And like all the young people, the only way to make contribution to the growth of this country is to experience the things that happen around us, to feel it. I've always known you as stubborn as your father. Benita, I know that studying in the prestigious university abroad will be of great benefit to you. Just like my sister son who just came back from abroad. Yes, you're right. But mom, I prefer studying here. The choice is yours. Anyway, my birthday is coming up. What are you planning for me? I hope lots of surprises. You will get an answer when your daddy is back. Surprise me, all. Let me check my hair. What do you want here? What kind of question is that? I told you before I'm pregnant, I'm carrying your baby, our baby. And I've told you that you are a dreamer. 
prove it with a DNA test or go and look for the father of your child. And I can tell that a cheap slot like you will have a million men to choose from. I know that. What? Tony, you talk to me this way? You seduced me? You impregnated me? And now you deny me? God! What? You see how easily you twist matters? Ego, you shamefully threw yourself on me with the help of your brother Johnson. Remember? Do you remember that? Submit yourself to a DNA test or remain out of my life for good. I don't need Stay out! Stay out of my life! Stay I out! I don't need the DNA test to prove what I already know. Tony, I'll be back. I'll be back and you'll be sorry. I'll be back to you. Guts to accuse you of impregnating her after you caught her at the hotel with her sugar daddy. Oh boy, see me see Wahala. Everybody knows how promiscuous this girl is. And now she's trying to push this pregnancy down my neck. Tony, Tony, I warned you by then that allowing a girl like that into your life will mean nothing but trouble. George, you're right. I should have listened. The house is finished. I need to go to the market to buy some things. Oh, um, Joyce, uh, oh, don't worry, I'll, I'll give you some money before I leave, okay? Okay, brother. Oh, boy. This is your little stepsister. She, she's growing every day. How time flies. Now you're quite right. Ever since I lost my mother, you know, she's been like a standing mother for me. Ah. Oh. Every time she comes in from school, it's always pampering. Pam, 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 pam. So, oh boy, have fun now. The boys at the club have been asking after you. Oh, no, no, no. The boys at the club. I mean, they, they should wait, I think. I have something more important to think about now. Like what? A new contract? A new girl? Benita or B. Williams. Benita or B. Williams. She's my classmate in school. That girl no get time for anybody. Eh? How you manage? Okay. <laughs> hey, no. How you manage? It's me. The guy just run into the beam. I don't understand. Oh boy! You're welcome. You are growing more and more beautiful each day. I am sure prospective suitors are constantly at your door this day. Oh, Mazi, that is very natural, given the quality of the flower in my possession. Well, Daddy, this flower is not yet ready to be taken. There you go again, Benita. What is wrong in marrying the right suitor? with the right financial and social status to, to, to make you happy. Uh, Agnes, the decision to marry or not is with Benita, not with you or I. I am not disputing with But you right. have to guide her. Oh. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> However, it's still her final decision. Uh, okay. <laughs> Benita, come on. Let's go to the kitchen. Uh, okay. uh, let's get something ready for uh, Make sure it's yeah. my special. <laughs> I know that it's very rare for you to leave the village. Mm. So to what do I owe this rare visit? Uh, well, Chief, the town council has planned an appeal fund and uh, launching of our road project. I see. And I'm here to consult you as to the chairmanship of the occasion. <laughs> <laughs> I know it. From the first day I saw you, I knew it. <laughs> I knew you came here for something. <laughs> but you are the chief. <laughs> it's all right. I will um, think about it and uh, consider what to do. Tony! Tony! You think you can sleep with my sister and jump out with an unborn child, huh? Johnson! I told your sister to go and have a DNA test. Bullshit! Bullshit, Tony! Did you ask her for a DNA test when you were sleeping with her? Look, Tony, I'll give you four days. Four good days to go and act a hand in marriage. 
as tradition requires. Oh, bullshit, Johnson. Bullshit! You guys must be crazy or something. What huh? do you think? I mean, what do you think? Mr. Johnson, a dear. Crazy? Deal with now, you. Now, be fool. Right. Fool! Shh. Fool! Now, get your random sister and get out of here now. We'll be back, Tony. We'll be back. And I swear you'll pay for this. I promise you, Tony, you must definitely pay for this. Fool. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, boy, see me see what I But wait till I do this guy now. What, what's my own fault now? Now, because I do, only say I do. Now, <laughs> do, be, now do be my crime now. Do. Now, let me do. I'm tired. I'm tired too, man. I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, give me Tony's as good as that. The first outing with him. Hmm. God, he treated me like a princess. <laughs> No wonder you're only smiling these days. I have to. <laughs> okay. I noticed you no longer argue with your mother. Mommy, that one. Mm. She never takes no for an answer. Hello, girls. Hi, mommy. Hi, Anne. How are you? Hello, well, this is Richard. Richard, my daughter, Benita. Her friend, Kemi. Hello, Benny. Hello. Your mom has told me lots of good things about you. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> well, my pleasure. Well, um, Richard is a manager with Apex Oil. He's the son of Otumba Femiata, your father's longtime business partner. And he's single. Oh, madam. We may have to go that far. Oh, well, I think it's nice we all know who we are. Please make yourself comfortable. I'll be right back. So, Ben, how's school? School is fine. I heard you guys were on strike or something. Well, um, it's the usual thing around here. Um, please excuse us, Sam. Hey, my friend, you want to go upstairs? Come on. All right. Okay. Okay. Innocent with me. You very well know that Richard came to see you. See me? But I did not invite him. What is wrong with you, Benita? You have an intelligent, handsome young man, a wealthy young man that wants to marry you, and you turn your back on him? Marry who? Me? <sighs> Mommy, this is the 20s, not the 90s or the 60s. I pick and choose whoever I want to marry. Look at you. You don't have an ordinary boyfriend, yet you reject a husband. Oh, mommy, you think I don't have a boyfriend? Sorry, I do have one. Aren't you supposed to introduce him to your parents? Aren't you?
Agnes, go and make sure that that wine I brought from Italy is very cold. That big one, you know. <laughs> Well, I hope so too, sir. <laughs> and thank you very much for inviting me to Oh, house. you're welcome. Help me. Mommy. This is Tony. Tony meets my mother. Tony, I'm so sorry. This is Tony. It's my pleasure, madam. It's my pleasure too. I'm glad my daughter chose a fine look. Let me see you, Benita. Uh, go and see your mother. Sit down. Yes. Ah. Well, I welcome you once more to my house. Thank you very much, sir. Yes. What do you do for a living? Uh, well, I'm into telecommunications. I see. Yes. Is that the young man who wants to marry you? Yes, Maureen. Is, is there anything wrong? Everything is wrong with that young man. Everything. Mommy, Tony. You, you, you don't even know Tony. Are you saying everything is wrong? What do you mean everything is wrong? Okay, why? Tell me what you think is wrong. Benita, he cannot marry you. What? Yes. You can't marry that young man. I cannot marry him. How? I, I don't get it. That man is the wrong man. He cannot marry you. It's as simple as that. Sure, Daddy. What do you mean by that? Are you not sure yourself? I mean, you are the one going to marry him and not me. Then why can't I marry him? Who says you can't marry him? Mom says so. She said Tony is the wrong man for me. What? Uh, uh, Benita, you should know your mother by now. Maybe she was trying to pull your legs. No, man. It's all right. Uh, it's all right. Agnes! Agnes! Tell Benita that Tony is not the right person for her. Yes, I did. You did. Why? How could you come to such a conclusion so quickly? You will not understand. Benita, our daughter, will be miserable all her life if she marries that young man. I don't understand. Why? They are not compatible. They cannot be husband and wife. Agnes, you talk as if you are the one going to marry this young man. Who told you they are not compatible? Darling, listen. Benita is our only daughter. I am particularly concerned about her life, her future, her happiness, the fact her entire life. Agnes, as far as I'm concerned, you have not given me any good reason. Please, please. please stop this. Stand, stand up. up. Stand up. What, are you, what do you want me to do? You cannot marry me. Yes, that is what I, that is what I keep hearing. He cannot marry me. He cannot. Why? You're not even considering the father I love and. 
and I want to be with him? Let me stop this! Stop it! Why? I mean, she acted so strangely the last time we shook hands. I knew something was wrong. There's no reason yet. I don't know what is wrong with my brother. I swear I do not. That's him. That's the man that beat me up because I told him I'm pregnant. What's your what? Young man, you are under arrest for assault and bashing on this young lady. Me? Yes. yes. When was that? Wait. Officer, you take him. Leave, leave me alone. Officer, you arrest him. Move him and let's go. Look, look, take him. I said, move. What's wrong with this guy? You should leave him alone now. Let me talk first now. When you get to the station, you know what I'm talking about. Move. 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 You, you, eh? You, you again, Abby. Send him in. You see what we did with the camera. Send him into the camera. set on marrying Tony. And it will take only a disaster to stop her. And that's exactly what it's going to be. Disaster if that boy marries my daughter. But why? You still haven't let her get married yet. Mommy! 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 He said he didn't do it. Do you believe him? It's possible he didn't. All I need you to do is call Paisa the good to bail him. What? Please or, or else I call another lawyer. Please. You never cease to amaze me anytime. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. You know, yeah, this is Chief Mrs. Obi Williams. How are you, Barista? I need your favor. my lawyer to come and bail you. Not because I'm interested in your affairs with my daughter, but because I'm concerned for her feelings. Please stay away from my daughter. I am begging you, stay away from my daughter as from now. But, but mom, you know I love your daughter. Why, why, why can't I date her? Tony, you will not understand. But please keep off. Whatever it will cost, I'll pay. Name your price. I'll pay. But well, please stay away from my daughter. Mom, mom you're paying. I am telling you for the last time. You're paying on my emotion. Stay away from my daughter. Is that clear? Mom, this is ridiculous. You're playing with my. And then after that, she kept coming closer and closer and falling. We knew it. We we go too far to go back. You know how these girls are. But I had to jail her when I heard she was seeing some other three guys. Carry your baby. So she claims, but she's refusing to go for a DNA test.
last thing I'll ever do is to deliberately hurt you. I, I stopped seeing Ego three months back. I mean, you, you know how these girls are. Please don't allow her to affect our present and our future. I love you. I love you so much. I don't want to lose you. God, I love you too. It's okay. It's okay. Alright. It's okay. Yeah. Well, um, that's good. Yeah, that'll be okay. That'll be very good. I would like to have some rest. You know, the police said it's fashion to keep you sleepless. So I need to rest and some rest now. I made the door open and there was nobody downstairs. I had to come up. Tony, I guess you still remember what I told you at the police station concerning my daughter. You know how difficult it is for a young man. I guess I won't take us anywhere now. Sit down. I want to know more about you, who your parents are, where you come from, everything about you. Um, my native name is Uzoma. My daddy told me that uh, we hail from Obowo, in the Mbano local government area of Imo State. My late mother, my late mother's name is Nkechi. I don't know what else you want, ma'am. You were raised by a midwife. How did you know? Is it true? Yes, God. God. What have I done to myself? Oh, Madam, what have I done to myself? Madam. Are you okay? Is anything the matter? You have grown to become such a good looking young man I never expected. I don't understand you. Tony, mother. please. Please, you cannot marry Benita. Why? You can't. Why? But, madam, you know how emotionally, I mean, how strongly we feel for each other emotionally. I mean, you can't do this to us. Benita is your sister. What? Yes. Your name is Uzoma. I gave you that name at birth. You're my son. You're my son. Please. What, what is happening? What is happening? I can't believe all this. I'm trash. It's true. It's true, Tony. I don't understand anything. Mother, what are you doing here? Oh, wait, wait. If you came here to convince Tony not to marry me, it's not going to work. Because there are so many things at stake here. Yes. There are more things at stake than you can ever imagine. But what are you talking about? Look, darling. Your mother here is saying that. We cannot marry because you're my sister. What? Yes. Mommy! Yes, it's 
my son. That's car. I don't have missed this car. This car was given to me at birth by a midwife mistakenly. Tony, you're my son. It's my son. I'm confused there. Wait, wait. What are you talking about? How? Then it's what I'm saying that your father is not even aware of it. In my final year in secondary school, I got pregnant and I gave birth to a son. But please, I've realized my mistake. Please forgive me. I know how painful it is for the both of you, but please. have his baby and when I do I would not abandon it the way your mother abandoned you for Tony. Look at this idiot! Look at you! See, let me tell you something. You can never ever have Tony, you hear me? Look at this rot. Oh you even have the effort to see me and talk to me. Look at this person you have the I effort to talk to me. Down. Do you know who I am? She's not what the no. trouble can go. Are you mad? You're fighting a lost battle. Look at this animal. Let's go. Come here Tony and see what I'll do to you. Leave me alone. Had a stupid girl that had the edge of the talk to me. This is a very dangerous situation. As your friend, my candid advice is that you withdraw from the relationship. At least till the fact that the woman is your true biological mother is proven. George, I'm in shock. I mean, just when I was getting used to the fact that I don't have a mother, she surfaces from nowhere, shattering my dreams. My world. Damn. Look, my cyber cafe business is suffering it. I'm not concentrating. I see how hard this is on you. But if it is true, if it is true, then there's trouble. A brother sleeping with a sister is an abomination before God and man. I advise you stop right now. But what is Benita's opinion in all this? Leave Benita out of this. Please forgive me, my husband. Don't open that you're dating man to beg me. Who knows how many more children you must have had before deceiving me into marrying you? 
Oh, you just want. You just want. Please forgive me, my love. Get your feet in hands off me. Mommy, please, 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 please. All this won't work. It is your gimmicks to prevent me from marrying Tony. It won't work. What are you even talking about? What is this I'm hearing? Benita! Benita! You see what you've got like this? Do you see it? I'm sorry. Max, there is fire on the mountain. Hmm. Disaster threatens to tear my family apart. Agnes, stop throwing words like gamblers. Go straight to the point. Ah. Max, you know that son I have, as a teenager? Yes. I remember that you gave that baby to uh, Mama Ijima, the midwife. Oh, yes. <laughs> Destiny has played a cruel trick on me. That boy is now a grown man. And that man is in love with my daughter Benita. Chineke! The fear of abomination! Is she not aware of this? <laughs> the gods of our lands will strike with vengeance for this sacrilege. I have begged Benita. I have told her to stop this incestuous relationship. But she's as headstrong as a father. She will not listen to me. Hmm. That's why I need your help. I see. Um, Agnes, an elder does not stay at home and watch a nanny goat die a child bath. Eh? I will seek solution to this impending disaster. Eh? Please, Mazi. I know you've always stood by me all these years. No problem. And I know you won't forsake me now. No, 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 no. You Please, don't. I'm counting on you to help me no. out. No, hey, no problem. I'm going to the village, eh? Okay. Is that waiting to hear from you? No problem. Okay. I'll see you, eh? Thank okay. you. Okay, Marzi. Safe journey, eh? Okay. Bye bye. I hope all is well. I just want to understand. Give this girl a touch when he finishes, okay? Ah, uh brother. -uh, what about money for Papa? Oh, shh. Uh, oh, Tony, I want to talk to you right now. Well, I just want to please manage the money with you, okay? I'll give you some money for the back side. I just want you to know that I am okay. Tony and I have decided to go away, to live our lives in peace, away from the pressures that you, mom, and others bring. I have enough money to last us till after our wedding. It's for the best, so please don't worry. Benita. No. No! Agnes! 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 Get hold of yourself! Agnes, come here. Agnes, help me. It was all my fault. Who is that? My fault. Forget about that. Agnes, it was all my fault. Let's just get the first. It was all my fault. This is the best. Take your back. Take your back. Let's go. Yes. Uh, you are Tony's sister. Yes, sir. Yes. Where is Tony? I don't know, sir. What do you mean, Tony? So Tony did not tell you where he and Benita were going? Uh, uh, no, sir. He did not. He only gave me some money and said he'd be coming from time to time to check on. Uh, Agnes, any luck? No luck. No luck. Benita's phone is switched off. Tony's phone is also switched off. God, what do I do? I should have listened to him. Listen to who? 
That's how Madi took me to a Dibia, and he said that Benita was already pregnant for Tony. What? Is he sure? I mean, how could he be so sure? He said if the necessary sacrifices were not done, that that they'll both die. That is total rubbish. I don't believe that. And you, Agnes, to think that you did all this without my consent? Please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You will be a lot more sorry when this is over. After so many years of marriage, I finally realized that I'm married to a total stranger. And you! about the scar. How does she know about the, 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 mid, the midwife's scar? Oh, Tony, please stop. I won't allow my mother to come and run my life for me to suit her. No. Tony, listen. I love you. I want you. Don't you understand? I understand, honey. I love you too. I love you so much. I love you so much to lose you. You're not going to lose me. Just this thing with your mother is crumbling my emotion. I mean, I, I'm confused. Oh, no, don't. Do not. I'll prove to you that this whole thing is just my mother's plan to tear us apart. Are busy. Come on. Let's get going before we get late for fellowship. Oh, that's true. No, it's all right. Um, honey, you come and make that dressed, okay? Love you. under pressure. I am cracking. I'm desperate. Whatever it will cost, I'll pay, okay? Consider it done, madam. But how about the boy? Do you want us to deal with the boy? No, 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 no. no. Don't touch the boy. Just find my daughter for me, okay? Please. I know I can count on you, yes. Okay? But madam, no, no. No, 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 no problem. No problem. That's waiting for you, okay? Madam, be madam. Tony, 
you have to come back home, the both of you. This madness is getting out of hand. Please, my children, come back. Let's straighten things out. Madam, there's nothing to straighten out. After our marriage, Penny and I will come home briefly to, 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 to tell you why we'll be doing our honeymoon. That's all. Tony, as my children, I love Benita and you so much. I can never lie to destroy your happiness. And please don't. Tony, Benita is your sister. As we talk now, she's pregnant for you. But how did you look? That is not important. What is more important is that the both of you are in great danger. Tony is an abomination and you know it. Please come. See what happened when you allow her to talk to you? Benny, are you pregnant? Well, I think so. The morning sickness is becoming more constant. But I still need to see your doctor. What if your mother is right? She's not! She's not! She gets it. She doesn't want to see us together. Papa, she wants me to marry Richard. Who's Richard? Please save that for another day. The main thing is that I am happy where I am. Come and smile for me, baby. Smile. Don't, don't Don't say anything. Please. No. Please. please. Look at me. Okay, look at me. For kissing. Look at me. Just look at me, okay? Look at me. Look at me. Okay. I can It's two hours left. Where on else can they be? Agnes, stop all this nonsense. How can you just trust in the words of a charlatan? I don't think anything has happened today. Right now, my friend, the state police commissioner, has so many boys working on this case, and he'll find them. Why don't you calm down? Come on, like this. Come on, sit down. Relax, relax. Relax. They will get them.
see, we all love you. That is why we decided to surprise you. Yes. yes. <laughs> we decided to set it up this way. It worked, didn't it? Happy birthday to you, my darling. <laughs> This is Namdi, my late sister's son. He's been in Ghana for 20 years.
from one room to the other like a two or two two room two or two from one guest room to the other from one room to another like a two or two well the action they have to know oh now go enter trouble one day oh now go enter serious trouble oh now go enter trouble one day oh now go enter 